So the very first thing we need to talk about is fingering. Every scale has fingering, very specific fingering, and there's a reason why. You want to follow this fingering exact. Now, when you, after you learn it, maybe if you want to sort of experiment with your own fingering, that's fine, but really learn the fingering that's there because this is the fingering that every single piano player in the history has learned. Every single piano player in history will continue to learn. Why? Because this fingering works, okay? So the first thing we can do is, rather than sitting here and playing the scale, we can put it in a block. A, and what we're gonna, we're gonna first play So as you can see, it's in a, a block, right? Okay, so how do we decide what to put in a block and what to play single? So really what I like to do is start with the first, then play everything else up until you have to do a pivot. So the, th the thumbs are where we pivot in E. Then we're going to put the thumb down. And then we have the rest of the scale. And then... Now you could do more. You can do, say... Um, change up exactly but I like to keep the hands relatively the same and this can go for any scale that you do say we do C so we have C the thumb is where we're gonna pivot for C as well so play up until that pivot note so in this case, you're going to pivot in the left hand on the five and then the four in the right hand. So it's going to clash a little bit, but that's okay. And then play the rest up until the next tonic. This works for everything. It works for the minors too. In that case, let me try that again. Now what this does is it really teaches us the exact fingering and the exact fingering we have to use. And when you play it like this, it's sort of, you'll sort of like feel it in your hands. Um, it, it's really the only way I can really describe it. You have to sit down and try it to kind of understand what I mean. But you'll feel it like... You'll feel it, you know? And now what you... After you've established this, you've already taught yourself the scale, actually. And it's sort of like a speedy way to do it. 